40 years old and above what do you want to see from us the millennials youtube what do you want us to do let us know okay so guys i don't have a car at the moment and uh, i'm not going to sit in the car at the moment and uh, i just want to see if this video will blow up because lately we've been seeing people sitting in the car talking while inside the car and also the door dash it's working anytime you use the door dash name anywhere in your videos i can see it's working guys so does it mean that youtube right now is only concentrated with people who make videos inside the car or does it mean that if you mention the door dash name it works because i want to see because right now i'm mentioning her name the door dash if you don't know about the door dash uh, she's uh, one of the content creators whose videos has really really blown out there and uh, i can see a lot of people are currently mentioning her name and uh, the videos are doing well actually if you want to know like a uh, I was planning to do another vlog today but um, the moment I woke up I saw one of my friends video like uh, he has blown up already he's at about 1.1.5 views he's at about 1.4 views and uh, the video was uploaded yesterday and I can see from the title what he wrote it's about the door dash and all that and uh, that video has blown up already and with the thumbnails too does it mean you have to like um, do something more about the thumbnail because i noticed his thumbnail too did a lot like uh, it's simple it's simple i don't know what's uh, what's up with youtube i wish youtube could have a way of telling us what it needs but currently i feel like uh, youtube needs authentic people the more authentic you are the more your video will blow up for real because um, from what i saw like uh, from the first time i saw the door dashes video that was the video that really blew out yeah before all others the first time I saw her video, I knew her from the video that was trending and she was inside a car and she was explaining about the um, five to nine jobs. Yeah, I don't know about the five to five to nine uh, jobs. Yeah, so she was talking about it and she was actually in the car. That is actually the first time I saw her. And I saw her videos and I got the interest of watching her yeah and then later on like, like um, after a day after seeing that video I also saw that she was monetized actually she was talking about the six to nine job um, uh, after she had released a video of her being monetized so I was wondering does this work because just after her I saw another video and guys remember these are people over 40 years old I don't know what's happening on YouTube I don't know but does it mean that right now the people who whose videos are blowing up are the ones with uh, 40 years old because the people that I have been seeing lately their videos they are people above 40 years old and uh, their videos are really really growing up guys i don't know what's up with us the generation the mini the millennial because i am a millennial i don't know what should we do what does youtube expect us to do because lately i've been seeing the the 40 years old and above videos they are really blowing up and uh with me like uh when i started uh, when i started youtube actually i started getting serious on youtube that was in september that is last month yeah i have been on youtube for a very long time but i didn't um i wasn't really creating videos 
I started creating videos uh, three years ago, but I wasn't really serious, yeah? I wasn't really expecting a lot uh, from YouTube because uh, I didn't expect like I, I would have subscribers the way I have at the moment, yeah? The first time I used to upload videos, it was just for fun and um, I just wanted to make things out of YouTube and uh, to save memories too because I love saving memories and um, I didn't really know that it can... Uh, blow up and uh i didn't really know actually it pays i didn't really know that and i wish i knew it from the start because i used to make videos that is on facebook and they used to blow up yeah i remember there was a time i made a i took photos actually uh photos of my house because you know currently that is part of what i do mostly like um interior decor apart from that uh I am more concentrated on traveling and adventure, which I love so much. I love to travel. I love adventure. And that is really what like uh, I wish I could concentrate on at the moment. But uh, the videos are not blowing up yet. So I'm still like, uh, I'm still contradicted on what to do. I don't really know because YouTube again has... Uh, has its own way of doing things. Like I hear you're supposed to be having a niche. With me, guys, if you really know me, if you really go to check my videos, currently, I wouldn't say that I have a niche because I do almost everything. I do adventure. I do travel vlogs. I do cooking vlogs. I also do, like, I show you the interior of my house, the way I have decorated my house. I show you myself, the way, like, uh, a morning routine of how I do with the beauty. So... I keep on researching, yeah, I keep on watching other channels like the Think Media, it helps me a lot. Actually guys, as you can see me, I was prepared to make this video, but uh, I just woke up, I just woke up now, yeah, and then I wanted to like have a shower and uh, put on a camera and talk about this, but I remembered again, YouTube wants authenticity because at the moment, the people that are trending, like uh, you can see like uh, the videos that are trending at the moment, they do not really, they don't seem as if a person has really worked, worked hard for the editing part and all that. I know there are a little bit of edits that we do, but you all know editing takes a lot of time. Like uh, you have to be... You have to to be to make sure that the videos like uh, they look great with the editing part with your thumbnails too you have to make sure that you're dressed properly because that is what i believed yeah in order for your video to trend you have to be dressed up properly you have to be seated somewhere like currently sitting inside the car really makes your video to glow up so I don't really know if this video will blow up because I'm not seated in the car. I'm just sitting here in my house. Yeah, this is the corner of my seat. And uh, I didn't choose to shower before having this video. I decided to be authentic, more authentic. You know, with my videos, I am authentic. But this one now, it is raw, very raw, authentic. So I just want to see if this video will blow up. Yeah, because... I feel like uh, YouTube just wants you to be you without like uh, trying a lot, yeah? YouTube wants you to be on camera, be authentic without trying to do a lot as long as you have the sound to talk and as long as you're more audible because that is what YouTube wants and also you have to make sure that your camera is clear enough. I feel like that is what YouTube wants it wants authenticity and i feel like that is what people really want to see because uh, you've been seeing a lot of youtubers like i try to follow a lot i try to learn a lot each and every time every day i spend like a, i spare an hour to just learn like uh, what really youtube wants <clears throat> what really youtube wants what will make uh, youtube to trend my videos and all that and I have realized lately because I watch a lot of like uh, the older generation that is the 40 and above because lately this is what I've been seeing on my timeline. Like their videos are blowing up and uh, <clears throat> they're not really doing 
<clears throat> they're not really doing a lot with the edits i won't say that they don't edit yeah i know there's a lot of um more work they put out there before like uh letting these videos out <clears throat> but from what you know guys you know like uh they're not really doing a lot from what we the millennials are doing so for today i just wanted to be more raw authentic more authentic and see if this works yeah as i told you guys i was planning to go take a shower make this hair much better yeah hold it because you can see i'm just from uh, i'm just from waking up and i decided not to do anything yeah I decided to come here and talk about this because uh, I see a lot. I see I've been seeing a lot of changes. So why, what if, if you don't have a car? Does it mean that uh, people will not watch you? What if I don't want to sit inside the car and make a video out of it, but I still want my video to trend? Will you watch it? And about the, the thumbnails, like, uh, does it mean that uh, the more simple they are, the more you get attention from people i don't know can people let us know like um and also like i have tried my best to to like uh i tried yeah youtube is not yet like paying me but i have tried to invest on uh, proper gadgets to use for my for my videos yeah i tried to like uh, buy a ring light which i don't really use it uh a lot of times i only use it when i want to to do live sessions yeah and when i want to sit down like this i'm using my ring light here to hold the camera for me so that is part of what uh the investments are helping me but uh, does it mean that um, you have to buy more gadgets to do this or does it mean that gadgets do not help because from the videos that are trending right now i don't think they are using a lot of these things that we guys are trying to like uh invest on i know investing on proper gadgets it's good proper lighting it's good because that is what youtube needs actually yeah youtube needs uh, clear pictures clear videos you need to be audible i do not have a microphone at the moment but i'm planning to invest on it so I feel like that is also something that we have to look forward to like uh, want or does it mean that it's time for the 40 years and above for them to trend yeah and what do 40 years like uh, want to see from us the millennials because i believe youtube is carrying away a lot of people yeah we have the teens we have the millennials we have the 40 years and above people who are always here and i believe that um with every video like uh, every niche has its own people has its own team uh there are several people who want to see like different videos from people from different continents from different worlds so i'm just here asking myself like uh, what what does youtube want exactly what do we do yeah because i'm not 40 years old yeah so what do we do as the millennials for our videos to trend because currently the 40 years are taking over and uh, not forgetting anytime you mention anytime you mention the DoorDash, your videos definitely will trend yeah they will trend i'm sure so for today i'm mentioning her name and uh, she's inspiring yeah she's inspiring that name it's not just a name if you go and check on her videos guys she's one of the people who inspires me a lot and uh, i really like um she keeps on giving us the the energy to go forward for it because i know with content creation there's a lot of criticism yeah she has really talked about it on her videos she's been talking about all that on her videos and uh, how much like uh, the time you spend in here it takes a lot it takes a lot yeah how much time you spend on editing how much uh, money you invest on buying proper gadgets it takes a lot and i really wish like a video could like uh, take note of us all of us yeah because i know each and every person does a lot to just uh, see her videos 
trending yeah we've been having uh, like uh, so many people here on youtube every day i wake up in the morning i see my friends i see family like uh, trying to do their best for their videos to trend and people are really investing a lot yeah for me i can say i am investing a lot because um i'm not pay getting any payment at the moment but uh I try my best to like visit uh, parks that is what uh, like I want to do mostly here on YouTube visit different countries visiting parks having adventures do camping and you know that cannot be done without proper financial planning so I'm still working on it but does it mean that um, just sitting here like this the way I'm seated here and uh, without trying to do anything extra does it mean that uh, youtube wants that in order for your videos to trend i would really like to know like uh, what does um, the 40 years and above people want to see from us the millennials because i know like for me I, I expect everyone to watch my videos as long as they are above 18 years i'm expecting everyone to watch my videos because i want to concentrate more on uh, the adventure lifestyle traveling just being authentic because like the first video i made on september i told you guys i'm trying my best to be different from what i've been seeing on youtube i just want to be the natural me where i can just wake up the same way i've done today like I wake up here just dress up the way i normally dress up when i'm indoors and uh just seated here taking my time just getting easy and uh, just being myself and uh, i want to see if this will blow up because this is what i want because i realize a lot of people are doing uh, like um a lot of aesthetic videos a lot of like um they do a lot of aesthetics and all that but with me i just wanted you guys to get used to me the way i am i can just wake up and uh, talk to you guys without having to worry about my rough hair about my face not having makeup on about uh, the clothes that i put on because i remember like um there was a friend of mine yeah there was a friend of mine who really like told me nancy you have to dress up in uh, sexy clothes in order for people to like uh, to like uh to get the attention from people but you know with me yes i i'm not saying that i don't dress up sexy sometimes i do that when i want to go on a date when i want to like uh go out because we all know i'm still a lady i need to go out i need to have some fun and i post to i post videos when i'm dressed up uh, like uh, i do that but you know with the uh, with what i really wanted yeah that is just part of uh, the other side of me which i don't really take it seriously yeah though i dress up i dress up sometimes and i post videos about it but uh, i just wanted to like um be on youtube be free on youtube without having to like uh, dress up without having to like uh, put on makeup for me to be like uh to be to be to be attractive for me to be identified i just want to be the natural me i just want to talk like uh being myself i don't want to try a lot in order for me to get noticed guys so do you think uh that will work really because i've been seeing like it's working it's working and i don't know if uh we are the ones who are doing it the wrong way because the daft dash for her it's working just being simple and most of the time she's uh, putting on t-shirts guys i'm on a t-shirt today yeah yeah she has simple hair like uh, her hair is very simple natural she's not having like the wigs on she's not having makeups she's just the natural she's just herself even expressing her joy moments her joyful moments she she's just herself and i feel like that is what i wanted from the start when i joined when i started getting serious here on youtube that is really what i wanted so does it mean it will work if we keep on doing that way uh if we don't try to do a lot if we don't try to like invest a lot of things yeah does it mean that youtube just wants simplicity or 
does it mean that youtube has its own way of making people trend of making videos trend i don't know i want to know from you guys yeah i also wanted to talk like uh, to to be like uh, sitting down and then planning things writing down on what to do on what to talk about like today i was planning to do that like uh i even wrote the notes and all that of what i'm planning to talk about but uh I decided to just be here and uh, just come here authentically without having books or anything. I just want to see if it works because I've been seeing it working for people, guys. Why not me? Why not me? Yeah. I just want to see if this works. I'm I'm prepared. I'm not prepared at all. You can see I didn't even get to have a shower. Yeah. I just came here to, to ask you guys, does it mean that you have to like... Uh, sit in the car or is it okay if i sit here yeah even uh, without going to sit in the car will i trend uh mentioning the daft dash she's an inspiration and she's she inspires me a lot um and also i love to i would love to include her on my videos too because she's the reason why like i get encouraged to come here be the same me be the real me be the authentic me just doing vlogs and uh, just remaining real without trying a lot yeah because i've been seeing people like a lot of people told me to try like putting on makeup and all that but i just want to be myself i don't want to follow what people are telling me because i am the one who started my youtube channel and i'm the one <coughs> I am my own boss here on YouTube and I depend on the people who are watching me to be the ones who like uh, to tell me what they need to see from me. And if my my audience hasn't told me that, I don't think I will follow anyone. Yeah. So guys, tell me, does it mean you have to be authentic for you to like a uh, trend? And also the few years old and above, what do you want to see from us, the millennials? Which videos like... Um, <clears throat> which videos do they like uh, which videos are you getting inspired with what do you expect from us <clears throat> and my generation yeah what do you aim to achieve on youtube <clears throat> what like uh what do you like uh what are we going to do because i know all of us are doing our best to to get there yeah so YouTube, what do you want us to do? Let us know, okay? This was just a talk. I didn't really plan about it. I just woke up and uh, I I was just about to go to shower, but I felt like there's no need to shower because there was something like uh, forcing me, please go out there and talk about this. Face the camera the way you are, the authentic you are. Face the camera and talk about this because... Uh, before I woke up, I had watched a video. Yeah, one of my friends, like, the videos are doing... The video that he uploaded yesterday, talking about this, talking about this, talking about how, like, he invested a lot to have this, talking about how he has been trying his best to, like, uh, get to know what really, like, um, attracts people here on YouTube, and talking about the DoorDash and... Uh, all others yeah because a lot of people are trending and they are the 40 years and above yeah so we want to know from youtube what's up will this trend and uh it's been good it's been a good it's been a good conversation so i hope to see you with another video again and make sure you subscribe okay thank you